My name is Wolfgang Mutspiel. I play acoustic guitar and electric guitar. This is my second album as a leader for ECM. It's called Rising Grace and it features Brad Melder on piano, Ambrose Ecking Musiri on trumpet, Brian Blade on drums and Larry Grenadier on bass. I'm a huge fan of all these musicians. Brian Blade is a gift. He seems to not have a preconceived notion of how the music should be. It really develops in the moment, which is always what we jazz musicians long for. He creates an intensity with relatively low volume. He gets the vibe of something immediately, or even puts it in another place that you haven't imagined. Larry is a very intense sound, present, even when he plays a few notes. So Larry is somebody who anchors the music but still leaves enough space for everything to happen. I've been listening to Brad a lot through all these years. The experience to play with him was amazing for me. First of all, he really, really listens and he really hears grasping music that he hears immediately and reacting to it in the most subtle ways. You know, that kind of subtle mastery is going on with Brad Mildow. There's something extremely egoless in the way he makes music. Ambrose, to me, is an incredible force in music, a new voice. There's a fearlessness and a really big joy in taking risks in his, in his playing, in his music. You know, he will respect the tune and the sort of the playground of, of my, my tunes, but he will always stretch it. He always knows which chords are going on and he always knows the correct notes, but he likes to play the, the other notes and make a tension between them and the original harmonies. And there's this kind of magic that he creates. You can't analyze it. We recorded this album at a studio in the south of France. We all basically set up in one room and it was a very concentrated flow. Two takes, sometimes three. Not much talking really. This kind of beautiful concentration. Everything is about the music, everything is about listening, deep listening. At some point during this recording, maybe the idea of everybody taking solos disappeared and it became more and more one constant web. This wasn't planned, but it came about because everybody likes that mode of making music. This web, which is way beyond you know anybody soloing and somebody comping, it's a real conversation, a constant conversation.